Hey guys, what's good? Mike here. Thanks for tuning in to another video. In this video, I want to talk about how to talk about and present your work within a UI UX design interview. Okay, somebody shot me this email. thought this was interesting because there could be several ways that you're thinking that you might need to present your work in an interview setting. Okay, it's not that difficult, but the value lies in how you speak about the projects that you've worked on. Okay, that's where the value lies okay so basically a lot of people might be thinking hey should i print out my screenshots do i have to present my work on a you know on a poster board and whatnot and how you see a lot of agencies present to clients no none of that stuff you don't need to do any of that don't print your screenshots out anymore i've done that in the past you don't have to you have to print that out okay you don't have to um you know uh tape your screenshots to a poster board or anything like that all right you don't have to have a three ring binder okay none of that bring your laptop that's it okay you get called into an interview you go with your laptop and your notebook or whatever your backpack okay but it's just your laptop is what you want to take with you because they're here you're going to they're going to give you an opportunity to plug in your laptop to the monitor or they'll have a, a computer already set up and they may have your portfolio pulled up on screen okay at some point they'll either give you Wi-Fi have you plug in go to your portfolio and present and speak to your speak um, to your projects or they'll pull them up and ask you to speak to your projects okay either or at some point in the, in the, in the interview you'll have an opportunity to speak on the projects that you worked on okay so that's that's the first and foremost okay that's how you get to the projects but the nuts and bolts comes in how you present and speak on your projects two things you want to focus on okay you want to focus on the the solution and what the app does for a particular user okay so you want to talk about what the project or what the app does and what problem is it solving okay whether you created this project on your own like a personal project or an app that you're working on for a company right now okay speak about what this does for its end users okay that's number one talk about the solutions that you're solving with this app number two now you speak on your process that's when you inject your ui ux design process and how you worked through your process to come up with these screenshots okay that's it two things the solution what this app is solving for the users in that marketplace and two your process on how you came about with these mock-ups all right now you may have projects right now personal projects that um, do not have a backstory you need to work on a backstory for each and every project you have before you go into an interview. Okay, have a story. Make something up. Why did you create it? To realistically, you probably have apps or, or projects right now that you just, you just did for visual UI design practice. And these are cool, beautiful looking apps. And they're good portfolio pieces, right? Come up with a backstory on it. All right, make one up. All right, maybe you created an app like a music app and maybe you give it a name music junkies okay when you get there in the interview speak on what this app is solving what problem it's solving and then speak on your process okay so you pull up a music app hey this is an app I did uh, it's called music junkies basically this is an app uh, that allows for users to socialize while they're listening to their favorite favorite um, songs okay i realized in the marketplace there wasn't a strong social network um, for music lovers especially uh, folks uh, while listening to their favorite songs they can socialize with other people that are streaming music yada 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 okay make up a story make up a story for that and so in the process of building this app, gathered my requirements on the diff different needs, um, researched other popular apps on the market, okay, sketched out 
interviewed a lot of uh, people in my family uh, on what types of music apps they listen to and what types of social networking sites they frequent and I combine those into this particular app and so forth. Okay, and you can go on and on through your process. Okay, study your UI, UX design process. Okay, and coming up with the visual UI designs, I browse different sites, come up with different ideas, and prototype these out, test these with family members and so forth. Okay, and that's how I came up with this end concept here. Then you go on, you know, go on to your next project. Okay, but you have to have a story for each of your project. This particular app, I built this uh, this app for Baja Fresh. This was an app where you can easily place orders um, online with simple click of a button without entering in credit card information. Something along those lines, right? So it's solving this, solving a particular need in the marketplace. Okay, so just go on and on, and then you go on with your backstory or with your with your process on how you came up with those mockups. But each and every project should have a story and a solution that it's solving. Okay, so it's hard to come up with what solution it's solving. Let's say I'm presenting an app I work on at ADP. Um, it's something that I didn't come up with, but I ADP has the business model I'm just an employee there and I've worked on these these projects and while I'm presenting these I shouldn't just say hey I work for ADP and this is something that I did um, this is a time and attendance app and you know they told me to do this and that was it no explain what that project or what that product does for users in the market Okay, this is a time and attendance app. This is an app for mid to large size businesses with 100 to 1,000 employees. It allows users to enter their time, allowing them to connect to their payroll system and easily submit payroll through ADP's processing system. Okay, stuff like that. All right, we gather data. So you have to have a story. Before I go into an interview, I make sure I go over each of these projects and I know what I'm going to talk about. And when I get to them, I speak intelligently on those projects and exactly what those solutions do, what they do for users, the end users, and my UI UX design process, how I, that was used through my efforts in coming up with those mockups. That's how you present in an interview. Probably said a lot, probably went over some things that's a little bit more advanced in the way I explain things. Watch the video over, practice, practice, practice. You'll get better at it. But those are the two things. All right, hopefully this was helpful. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the thumbs up. If you like the things I talk about, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. And as always, visit my website, mlwebco.com if you want to ask me any questions uh, in relating to UI, UX design, or learn about myself, and I'll be happy to answer those questions for you. We'll talk soon, guys. Catch you in the next video. Bye.